We're over at Lakeshore RV, checking out a 2018 Sprinter Limited 312 MLS. The Sprinter sleeps up to five, although this unit in particular only sleeps up to four because there is a uh, freestanding dinette instead of a booth dinette, which you'll see that in a moment. But it does have three slides, a hitch weight of 1,020 pounds, a ship weight of 8,440 pounds, and a GVWR of 11,000 pounds. The length of this travel trailer is 35 feet 2 inches, height of 11 feet 3 inches, and width of 8 feet 4 inches. We also have a freshwater tank of 81 gallons, a gray water tank of 68 gallons, and a black water tank of 34 gallons. And as we take a closer look at this, tour, this uh, travel trailer, you'll see a nice high gloss fiberglass front cap here with a LP tank uh, hidden nice in this little cubby hole there, a little bit different than some of the other uh, Sprinter Keystones here. But you can see there's also the battery hookup right there as well as the leveling jack up front. So we work our way around. You'll see on this side there is the two slides over here. And we continue checking out all around here. Of the rear of this unit which has a spare tire here in the back. As we go around, you'll see a nice awning with LED lighting underneath it. And then, of course, this absolutely beautiful outdoor kitchen. This outdoor kitchen has a two-burner range right up front here, as you can see. Also has an HD TV behind that and a miniature refrigerator here next to it. So all this in the comfort of your awning makes it for a beautiful place to be able to have a cookout and enjoy and relax the outdoors next to your RV. We continue to the back up to the front of this Sprinter here. You'll see up front the pass-through storage right here. This pass-through storage goes all the way back and through. Has a nice hard uh, bottom right here, so that way you don't have to worry about uh, liquids and whatnot with any type of carpeted area. Uh, nice little added piece in there. And then, of course, we have a three-step aluminum entryway here into the main unit, as well as a large grab handle. See, this is a 20th anniversary edition. Nice little lit-up um, logo there. Nice little, nice little piece to add. Now, as we come inside the unit, you will see directly is the control center here right up front. So this is where you can control your slides, your lights, your awnings, and all that. Nice bright LED lights, as well as a nice little LED uh, accented Sprinter logo up there. I said this, this one has all the bells and whistles to it. Now, when you turn left into the main area, you'll see the absolutely large living slash kitchen area. There's that freestanding dinette that I talked about that they swapped out. Uh, you'll see the nice two uh, love seats right here with cup holders. And uh, fold out footrests there, come out. There's also the jackknife sofa right there, comes out for the sleeping space. And then across from that is the absolutely massive HDTV with sound bar underneath that has the AM, FM, USB radio all in there. All over top, a beautiful fireplace. So, wonderful area for an entertainment center. Above the couch over here we do have some extra storage spots right up in here with a nice glass inlay very nice and classy there and with that we can go ahead and take a look at the kitchen area so we have this nice peninsula bar stool seating here we got these nice little bar stools with a solid surface countertop running throughout we have the freestanding dinette with two ch or not two chairs with four chairs two on each side but of course it is surrounded also by a lot of windows. These windows are tinted and frameless. Wonderful for being able to get a just marvelous view without having to worry about all of the heat coming in and heating up your RV too hot. Above in the kitchen you have a nice skylight up above, nice pleated so you can be able to filter that light out just a little bit. Now as we take a closer look at the kitchen you'll see a nice three burner range and stove top here. I'm going to go ahead and open that guy up take a peek inside very nice above that we have the vent and fan and on top of that a nice microwave just like that we have some storage cabinets on the side here open up 
you know, all throughout. There's another one of those glass inlaid doors right there. Nice deep space in there. And some more up top all the way around. Now, of course, this is all over the undermount stainless steel basin style sink here with the pull off sprayer head, which is very nice and convenient. Got another couple of windows back there with some nice valances to really class this set up. Then we have your outlet, and you also have a USB charger over here, too, so that way you can conveniently charge all your electronic devices. And then right next to those is the stainless steel refrigerator. Up top we have the freezer and below the refrigerator. Very nice a large area in there. Nice stainless steel style right up there. You'll of course notice all of the wood trim throughout this entire unit. Very nice. Makes it very classy and homey inside of here. Wonderful place to entertain and to enjoy a nice meal. And with that, we can go ahead and move towards the front of the unit here, where we'll take a step into the master bathroom. Inside here, you have a nice foot flush toilet, a corner radius shower there. We can go ahead and take a peek inside of that. Go ahead and open up this guy, just like so. So, nice and there. We have a nice skylight above there and a detachable head sprayer. And up above on the ceiling, of course, is also the van, the vent fan. Close this guy back up. And next to that is the stainless steel sink, some cabinetry down below, and above a mirrored medicine cabinet that we can open up and take a look at. So plenty of room to be able to put all your bathroom essentials in. Now then, as we turn around to the slide door here, that actually enters into the master bedroom. So you can see this nice three-door wardrobe he over here, one in the bathroom, which is nice for, you know, putting in um, towels and whatnot. And we open up these drawers, these uh, nice full glide extension drawers, not only in here, but throughout the entire unit. Close those guys up. And you can see more over here. So we have plenty of space all throughout, just like so. Now inside the master bedroom, you have this absolutely large bed right here with some nice seating space right over there. And you have an outlet over there and a shelf so that way you can charge up your electronic devices while you sleep. Again, you have this nice overhead storage area that pops open all the way across with that glass inlay. We have another overhead vent above. We have two windows, one on each side. Great for opening that guy up and getting plenty of natural breeze and airflow through here. So you'll see that there is also inside of that cubby some also some uh, outlets as well. So plenty of outlets to charge all your stuff. Now on this wall there is uh, room to be able to hook up a TV mount so that way you can have an entertainment center inside of your bedroom as well. And there you go. Go ahead and go back into the main living area. So this has been the 2018 Sprinter Limited 312 MLS travel trailer over here at Lakeshore RV. You can Come check us out where we can give you a walkthrough of not only this, but over 500 other units that we have in stock. You can also check us out online at lakeshore-rv.com where you can see our entire inventory at the comfort of your own home. You can, of course, also give us a call at 231-760-8805 where we can get you in contact with one of our friendly and knowledgeable salespeople where they can help you find the RV perfect for you and your family. We look forward to from hearing from you.